series of programs that help low-income and disabled students enter college. That's what brought advocates from across Maine to the State House today. Kadichi Lawrence has more. Trio programs across Maine gathered at the State House Wednesday. About six different programs here from around the state. We had veterans upward bound from the University of Southern Maine. We had upward bound programs from the University of Maine Presque Isle and the University of Maine. Including the University of Maine Farmington and Thomas College, their goal was to raise awareness and support for the federally funded program that helps low-income citizens enter college, graduate, and move on. The trio actually began uh, with the federal government under President Johnson as part of the war on poverty. So basically we work with first generation economically disadvantaged students. Richard says they help students with everything from college tours. To help them get on different campuses and see what college life may be like. To the application process and even tutoring for those who need it. We work primarily with students whose parents never went to college. So right off the bat, they, they are at a disadvantage because they don't know necessarily what it takes to get there. They also work with students with disabilities and some who are parents. So they're navigating how am I to be a parent but also you know do this for myself and go to college. An estimated two million trio students have graduated from college since its start. Richard says they even help grade school students as early as sixth grade. Maybe they're in the foster care system or they're a ward of the state. That is why she says it is important to spread the awareness that there is help through programs like TRIO and HOPE. We just provide whatever support we can. We are academic programs, but we offer a lot more support than just academic. Kodichi Lawrence, WABI-TV5 News, Augusta.